Yo, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to this video. In this video, guys, I'm going to show you guys how to make the outfit in the thumbnail, which is this black jogger with a black modded CEO bodyguard vest. After it's patch 1.15, now, this, guys, this is a transfer glitch. The transfer glitch will remove all your saved outfits except one of your outfits. So all your saved outfits will get removed except one. If you guys like this video or it did help you out, drop a like down below, subscribe. If you guys please subscribe to the channel, that'd be greatly appreciated. Um, you can join the current Discord, all the links will be in the description. You can guys some, go subscribe to my backup channel, which uh, will be the link in the description as well. So like I said guys, this will remove all your saved outfits except one of them. So this outfit will cost you around $40,000. And also, guys, your first character has to be a male, and your second character has to be um, a female. So your male character has to be in slot one, and your female has to be in slot two. Otherwise, this glitch will not work, and you guys will just lose all your outfits for no reason. So once you guys get to any clothing install, you want to delete all your saved outfits. And what you guys want to do is you want to wear the outfit what you want to keep. Okay. So I'm keeping this, as you guys can see. I'm keeping this. Um, I am keeping this black ripped t-shirt modded outfit so that whatever outfit you guys want to keep when doing this glitch make sure you wear it and then delete all your outfits so after you guys have deleted all your outfits and by the way guys this does obviously remove all your saved outfits but for a high chance to hit it make sure you guys do remove them um, I just recommend removing them anyways even though it does it just do it anyways um, so I'm going to be keeping this black modded ripped jogger outfit right here so make sure you equip it okay and then what you guys want to do is actually delete all your outfits I'll or whatever just click swap character okay once you guys do load into swap character you guys um want to make a female character if you guys already have a female character go on to that and use it and by the way guys we will be deleting our female character after so yeah make sure that if you have like a load of cars and like you know outfits and businesses and stuff on your female character which is in slot two which is on the furthest to the right Make sure you guys don't do this unless you guys don't mind losing all them cars and stuff. But I, I don't mind, I'm going to make a new character because this is my backup account. So this is, I use this mainly just for doing transfer and other videos. What remove my saved outfits, what I don't like to do on my main because all my mains got my best modded outfits. So yeah. So what you guys want to do is you might have to copy a rank if you do. and Just do that, okay? And if your characters are male, um, when you're creating one or when you go on one, just make sure it's a female and then you don't have to change any of the styles or anything. Just make it a female, name it or whatever, and then you know, just head into GTA online. Okay. So yeah, just name it anything you want, make sure it's a female character or this glitch will not work. Make sure you, your male character is in slot one and your female is gonna be in slot two. If not, then this will not work. And also guys, um, yeah, I do have a second channel, so if you guys want to go check that out, it's just called Spooky Ghost. Um, so yeah, but I'm going to cut this part out because I, I don't think you guys want to see this casino part, so I'll, cu I'll cut to when I finish this cutscene. Alright guys, so what you guys want to do is, is you guys want to head to any clothing store there is on the map. Um, so like you guys see on my screen right now, um, you want to go to any clothing store. Now, however, if the clothing store does not pop up on the map, um, just find a new session, so I'll show you guys what I mean right now. Um, it probably will sh sh uh, show up for me, but it might not at the same time. So just wait for this to load. But like, if you don't see the icon on the map, so as you guys can see, if I go to my map, there's no like clothing store icons on the map. So as you guys can see, there's obviously no icons on the map showing um, like you know, like the clothing store. So if you get what I just did, uh, where you can't see the clothing store on the map, just find a new session. And then head to the clothing store when it shows up on your map. I'll see you guys when I've um, got it made to the, go, look, gone to the clothing store and I'll show you guys how to make the outfits for this glitch game. Okay. okay, guys, so once you guys do get to any clothing store you guys um, get to, to make these outfits so we can do this glitch, you want to come to pants, okay? You want to go to um, utility pants and you want to put on number 37, the black battle, battle pants, okay? Then you guys want to go to tops, okay, you want to go, you guys want to go down to, um, bustiers, and you guys want to put on the la white lace bustier. Then you guys want to go back onto clothing, and you guys want to go down to, um, I forgot the name, sports jackets, um, you want to equip the blue puffer jacket, which is in the number 101, okay, you guys want to equip some, the heavy armour, now, I do have the light armour, okay, disclaimer, right? I am not a high enough level, 
right, I've already realized I'm not a high enough level. I need to be level 20, okay, to put on the heavy armor. Um, so if you guys want to, if you guys want like the modded vest, which you guys um, will see in the thumbnail, whatever, you guys need to put on the heavy armor, which is like the it's, it's the green heavy armor, okay? Not not hard to know, but um, I'm gonna be putting on the light armor. Don't know if it makes, don't know what it does, but it don't, make sure you guys are putting on the heavy armor. I could not do that because well. I'm not high enough level to do that, but whatever. Um, just want to state that. Um, you want to take off any accessories, and you want to put on. So you want to take off any like um, earrings and stuff. And you guys want to go down to gloves, and you want to put on the black woolen gloves. Okay. Once you guys have got that, um, you guys are um, set free to save this as. Make sure you guys save this as slot two. Okay. Just a slot two. And then for the next outfit, you can keep the, the bus steer. You guys can keep the bus steer um, and the um, armor and you guys can keep the jacket. All you guys want to do is change the shoes. All you, all you need to do is um, change the pants. So you guys want to go down to um, sports pants and you guys want to put on the spotted muscle pants number one. After you guys have put that on, um, then pants. All you guys need to do now is change your shoes. So what you guys want to do is go to boots. Then you guys want to put on the red cowboy boots. Um, the number 49. Okay. After you quit, then you want to save this outfit in slot 3. Okay, slot basically it's slot 3 guys, you know. It's slot 3. Um, so you've got to save it. Underneath slot 2, slot 3. Save it. After you guys have done that, um, you guys want to kill yourself. Um, I can't do it because I obviously went in passive mode, but um, yeah, you guys want to kill yourself. It doesn't matter how you do it, just want to kill yourself. Um, I'm going to have to wait about 20 seconds. Um, but guys, make sure you guys are putting on the heavy armor, the, the green heavy armor, okay? Now, the reason why I'm not putting on the green heavy armor is because um, I don't have it unlocked, but if you guys want to get the full modded outfit which i'm meant to be showing you guys and make sure you're putting on the heavy armor um so yeah if this video did help you out please subscribe down below it would be greatly appreciated once you guys can take take the easy way out or like shoot this guy yourself with an rpg guys either or does not matter um i can't actually kill myself so i think i have to take some money out of my in-game bank so you know to push off some money you know Okay, and after you guys have killed yourself, okay, took the easy way out. When you guys have took the easy way out, you guys want to, when you respawn, you guys want to change, select through the outfits, okay? Like, just keep selecting through them all the time, okay? And then, you guys um, want to load into creator. Once you guys do load into creator, you guys want to create a land race. So, so you guys want to the land race. Okay, so once you guys do get in the land race, you want to fill out all the information, so the title and the description, is name it GG, like I did or something. You know, take the photo, like you guys um, do see, and you guys want to put the um, race, you guys want to put the um, race type on, um, leave it on what it was, I can't remember what it was on actually, uh, standard, and you guys want to just change the cast, whatever you want, does not matter what, you, what it is. But after you guys have filled everything out, you want to just uh, walk, teleport over to the airport. There you guys do see. Okay, so once you guys do get to here, you guys want to go to race details. You want to put the, the maximum players on free. I've um, got to explain this part, just realised. Put the maximum players on free and then a route, route type on the point to point. Make sure you guys do that. Now you want to place a trigger anywhere, does not matter. Bobby camera does not matter. And then the checkpoint, you want to make it at least one mile long. So you want to get rid of that um, the, the triangle, the red triangle down in the bottom right. What, so you need to make it over a mile long. Once that um, triangle, the, the red triangle disappears, then you guys can just test the race. As you can see, you can uh, place checkpoints until it goes. It's usually about a mile long and then it'll go away. So place checkpoints everywhere I can do it. Place checkpoints everywhere. Once you do it about a mile long, um, you guys should be alright. So after you guys have set it a mile long, you guys want to just test the race. Okay. 
So like I said guys, you can change this to whatever car you want, so you can do it a lot more quicker. I actually have to put the cat in the so in the plastic, but it's all good. But all you guys want to see me do now is if you guys want to just like complete the race, like, like you guys do see me doing it on the screen at the minute. So it doesn't, it doesn't matter how, how long it takes to do it. This video may be a bit long, I'm not too sure, it depends on how much I edit it down, like how much I cut the clips and stuff, but anyways, once you guys complete it, you're going to accept this complete completion alert, as soon as you accept it, you're going to click pause, go to online, and you're going to click choose character, okay? That's all you want to do, don't do anything else, just go to choose character. Once you guys do all into this, you want to delete your female character. I stress this enough. Do not accidentally delete your male character. Make sure you guys delete your female character, the one we just made all the outfits on. Yes, delete it, okay? And if this works for you guys in the comments, leave a comment down below so other people know it does work for definite. Um, so you want to swear to delete, and you want to type delete, okay? So you want to type delete. Delete. And then, yeah. You want to delete it. You're going to delete it. You're going to put circle to return to story mode. Okay. So you're going to put circle to return to block about five. So what you guys do get in the back into story mode. You guys just want to head over to invite on the session. And guys, you will need a, the, the, the money bodyguard rest for this. You do not ha know how to get it. Um, it's, I've got a video on my channel called like how to get a modded CEO vest glitch or something. Um, it wasn't too long ago, it's probably about a month or two ago. Um, go back on the videos and you should be able to find it how to get a modded vest. Uh, make sure it's the male character one where you use the CEO and stuff. Anyways, what you guys do? I do have that video, so I'm not going to show you guys how to do it in today's video, but I will be. You guys can go and see it on my channel. So I'll see you guys when I'm uh, back in the invite over session with the CEO guys. If you don't know how to get it, obviously go check the video on it. I forgot to mention this guys, but before you go and do the glitch to get the money body armor, which I show, which I said if you go and watch a video on my channel, I do have a video on how to get it. Before you guys do anything else, what I'm about to tell you, um, the, you should spawn in with the outfit, what you chose to keep and keep on and save. As you guys can see, I chose to keep this outfit, and as you guys can see, I still got it. So make sure you go save this outfit in slot number ten. So when you guys go save it at the clothing store, make sure it's, uh, make sure the clothing store, make sure you save it in slot ten. Okay, so make sure you save it in slot ten, right? And then then you can go do the CEO vest part, which I told you guys to do. If you don't, if you guys already didn't know, the video on my channel. Okay, so I'll see you guys when I've got the vest. Alright guys, so once you guys have got the CEO vest, which is this outfit right here, um, you guys want to go to Falls Online, Jobs, Play Job, Rockstar Creating, and you guys want to start the mission, um, Crooks Cop. So mine's in my recently played because I don't have it unlocked, but I have it unlocked in my recently played, if that makes sense. So, so you guys go, Crooks Cop, um, I'm going to start Crooks Cop. Once you guys do start Crooks Cop, you want to invite a friend or any random person. Um, and just start it and I'll say guys I'll, sh I'll, I'll come and also guys set the clothing to play it owned once you guys set the clothing to play it owned invite a friend or a randomer and then start the job I'll, I'll come back to you guys when I've got someone in the um, game with me okay alright guys so once you guys do get someone in your game it can be a friend or a random and you guys have got the CEO outfit on you guys just want to when you load in with play your owned outfits on you want to go down to play your own outfits you want to go twice to the right so you owned outfit go once to the right and then two times to the right and then you guys just see that the modded bodyguard vest does merge over so if you click two times to the right you guys should see that it should merge on okay as you guys can see right here it merges on and after you guys have done that you want to click ready to play um and sorry guys i didn't explain this i'll 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 try and put it at the start of the video that you'll need an earpiece. Um, so you need an earpiece. I'll, I, if I remember, I'll try and edit it at the start. So writing on, on the screen that you'll need an earpiece. So once you guys have got your earpiece or whatever it is, 
Yeah, so you guys will need an earpiece. You want to hold down the interaction menu, go to style, accessories, put on the earpiece. After you put on the earpiece, you want to go to the phone and quit the job free phone. Then you guys should load back into um, a public session or any type of session. You should load in with the outfit on. If you, if you guys look, you should have the outfit on. And then all you guys got to do from there is save the outfit. And to be honest, guys, this is a dope, 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 dope outfit because I'm going to put a bulletproof helmet on it. Um, I'm going to put a rebreather on it and I'm going to put a modded open black duffel bag on it. Um, so yeah, that is pretty cool. But I'm going to prove to you guys that I do have it, as you guys can see. And I'm going to stress this enough. This is not a clickbait video. Just want to warn you guys now. This is not a clickbait video. This is all legit, okay? As you guys do know, any videos I upload, they are not fake. And if you're watching this a year later and it doesn't work, don't be surprised. They could have pa probably patched it, but no in time. But 9 times out of 10, they won't have run. Because this is a different... This is one of the glitches that they don't really patch, because it's pretty passive but if it's something like a money glitch and you're watching it a year later nine times out of ten it's going to be patched does it mean the videos could be it means it's patched yeah. but this will probably never get patched if it does it'll probably be in years time or something but once you guys come here you guys want to save it in slot um number 10 name it anything you want i'm going to name it um vest um and after you guys have saved it, you guys can do anything to you want to it now. So you guys can put a, a bulletproof helmet on as, as I'm going to be doing. Uh, I'm not going to be showing me doing it in the, I'm not going to show me doing it in the video, but um, I'll, I'll say also, guys, you guys can take the um, you know the the fucking earpiece off. But yeah. That's it in today's video. If you guys enjoyed, smash the like down below, subscribe to the post notifications. Been your boy, Axe Ghost, and I'm signing out. Peace.